Seven things your pee is trying to tell you about your health. As weird as it may sound, every time you go to the bathroom, you have a chance to check up on your health. No, we're not talking about stepping on the scale or checking your face for breakouts. We're talking about going number one. Yep, that's right, folks. By examining the color of your urine, you can see whether your body is doing all right or if you need to go to the doctors. More specifically, we'll tell you the possible colors you can see and what each color says about the condition of your health. We'll also give you some suggestions on what you should do for each problem. Number 7. Orange If you notice that the color of your urine has suddenly changed to orange, don't worry just yet. As it turns out, some anti-inflammatory drugs, chemotherapy treatments, and laxatives with senna can cause such a color change. Or the reason could be even simpler. Are you eating too many carrots? No joke! The pigment of beta-carotene found in carrots can turn your urine orange. If you're sure that none of the above apply to you, try drinking more water. You could be dehydrated, so your urine is super concentrated. In this case, the color can vary from dark yellow to orange. If you up your water intake, the color should go back to normal in a couple of hours. While drinking more water is highly recommended, also check your eyes. If you notice any yellowish tint in the whites of your eyes, then that along with orange urine can be a sign that your liver isn't functioning properly. There's nothing you can do here on your own, so make an appointment to see the doctor ASAP. Number 6. Pink and Reddish Seeing pink or reddish urine usually sends most people into a panic. But it's not really something to immediately freak out over. It could very well be caused by some foods or medications. If you've recently eaten beets, blackberries, or rhubarb, then you probably have nothing to worry about. Some of the compounds in these foods that make them red are excreted into your urine after the kidneys do their job. If foods like this are to blame, your urine should go back to its normal color by the next day. If it doesn't, call a doctor. Another reason could be that certain antibiotics, like rifidin and rimectane, that are used to treat tuberculosis can turn urine kind of reddish. If you're taking something to treat urinary infections, like phenazopyridine, your urine might look pink. Remember that you should never take any serious medications, including antibiotics, without a prescription. And your doctor should warn you about the side effects. If he doesn't, be sure to ask. And one more reason why urine can turn pink or reddish is the reason that most people are aware of. There's blood in it. Blood in the urine is a sign of urinary infection, kidney disease, cancerous or benign tumors, or bladder or kidney stones. If you see any blood clots or other tissues in your urine, don't hesitate to see your doctor. Doctors say that such symptoms are often underdiagnosed, especially in women because they usually shrug it off as a weird period fluke. Number 5. Green or Blue Seeing these colors in your pee is probably the most shocking of all since they look as unnatural as it gets. Well, maybe not for Smurfs or the Grinch. But seriously, for a human, this would really scare the bejesus out of you. Again, eating some foods, like those that are artificially dyed or asparagus, can discolor the urine to such an extent that it's blue or green. If it's because of this, there's nothing to worry about. It'll clear up in a day or two. Plus, medications like amitriptyline, indomethacin, and propofol can cause these types of colors too. However, if none of these reasons seem likely to you, you should be dialing the doctor's number right now. Better yet, dialing 911 would be even wiser. Forget about making an appointment. Green urine can be a sign of a rare urinary tract infection caused by the bacteria Pseudomonas. This bug can also cause kidney stones, which, as you can imagine, are not very comfortable when they try to make their way out of the body through the urinary tract. Yikes! Number 4. Brown Wait, are we still talking about number 1? Oh right, sorry. If you notice brown shades in your urine, 
it could be a sign of severe dehydration. So put down those caffeinated drinks and get more water into your body. Also, try to recall if you've eaten any rhubarb or fava beans lately. If you excluded these foods and you know that you're drinking lots of water, but the color doesn't go away, you guessed it, contact your doctor. Brown urine indicates problems with your liver and kidneys. Attention! If your brown urine is accompanied by abdominal pain, rashes, and seizures, there's a high possibility that you have a genetic condition. Also, blood turns kind of brownish when it disintegrates, and this can be a sign of a more serious condition like a tumor. As you can see, whatever the possible reason is, the best course of action is to consult a specialist. Don't waste your time hoping it'll go away. Number 3. Foaming or Fizzy Having foamy urine from time to time is normal. It's usually caused by the speed of urination. You know, like when you've been holding it forever on that long drive just praying for a rest stop. If it's foamy after you've just shot that stuff out of you like a jet sprayer, don't sweat it. But if it keeps coming back and you notice it more and more often over time, who are you going to call? The doctor. Foamy or fizzy urine can also be a sign that there's an excess of protein in it. This requires professional evaluation because you might have a serious kidney problem. We're not trying to scare you, we just want you to be safe and healthy. Number 2. Transparent If your urine is transparent, it's a sign that you're drinking too much water. Yes, too much is just as bad as too little. It's like Goldilocks, you've got to get it just right. So drinking too much water can lead to certain risks, the most important of which is diluting the salts in your body. This can create a problematic chemical imbalance. So drink less water for some time in order to check if that really is the reason your pee is transparent. Number 1. Pale straw yellow, transparent yellow, or dark yellow. And finally, some colors that you, hopefully, are used to seeing and shouldn't worry about. Ideally, your urine should be a pale gold color. If you are lucky enough to have perfect colored pee, it means that you're not under or overhydrated. You drink just as much water as you need. Good for you! If your urine is more concentrated and doesn't look pale gold, it means that you need a little more water. Remember one golden, no pun intended, rule. If it looks like lemonade, you're doing just fine. Do you pay attention to the color of your urine or do you feel weird checking it? Tell us in the comment section below. Like this video and send it to your friends. You never know, they could be noticing some of this stuff and be totally unaware of what to do.